Welcome to one of the most remarkable historical and cultural sites in Sri Lanka, Sigiriya Rock. Known as the Lion Rock, this ancient fortress is not only a UNESCO World Heritage Site, but also a symbol of Sri Lanka's rich history and engineering marvels. Sigiriya was built in the 5th century AD by King Kashyapa, who chose this massive rock as the location for his royal palace and fortress. Rising nearly 200 meters, 656 feet from the surrounding jungles, the site was strategically perfect for defense. But this wasn't just any fortress. It was a symbol of Kashyapa's power and ambition. After taking the throne in a coup, he sought to build an impregnable stronghold in case of attack. The name Sigiriya means Lion Rock, and this comes from the grand entrance that was carved in the shape of a gigantic lion. Today, only the lion's paws remain, but they give us an idea of the sheer scale and grandeur of the original entrance. Visitors would have entered the fortress through the lion's mouth, adding a layer of intimidation and awe to the experience. But Sigiriya is more than just a military fortress. It's also famous for its ancient art and architectural design. Along the western face of the rock, you'll find the Sigiriya frescoes, paintings of beautiful women, believed to be either celestial beings or members of the king's court. These frescoes are considered masterpieces of ancient Sri Lankan art, showing the kingdom's appreciation for beauty and culture. Another fascinating feature is the mirror wall. This highly polished surface once reflected the frescoes, and even today, it contains ancient graffiti, some of which are poems and comments left by visitors from over a thousand years ago. Once you've made the climb to the top, you'll be standing on the site of King Kashyapa's palace. Here you'll find the ruins of royal buildings, water gardens, and the king's throne. The engineering marvel doesn't end here. Even at this great height, the site had advanced hydraulic systems that channeled water up to the summit for fountains and pools.